Once Dr. Staub got the results of my HPV test back, he revealed to me that I had a high risk strain of HPV, which causes cervical cancer. I went back to his office and he opened this book and was showing me the diagram of the woman's internal organs and everything and he started explaining to me about the HPV test and about precancerous cells and exactly what areas he was paying particular attention to. Then Dr. Staub told me that he needed to perform a biopsy. She came in later for a microscopic evaluation of the cervix called a colposcopy exam and a biopsy was done of the cervix which revealed fairly advanced precancer cells. Subsequently she was taken to the operating room and on a diagnostic surgical procedure which identified an early cervical cancer. I was flabbergasted. I really could not believe that a woman who had had so many normal pap smears could have a harboring advanced cervical abnormality and in fact early cancer. This cancer would not have been diagnosed if she'd only had pap smears without the HPV testing done at the same time.